Hello everyone, this is Greg, and welcome to this Minecraft build tutorial. On this episode, we're going to create a desert-styled ranch house. This ranch house is unique, and it will look great in your desert biome of your Minecraft world. This house has two floors, a sturdy stone entranceway, many cactus in the yard, as well as a bedroom, bathroom, and a kitchen. This build is a very quick and easy build, and I cannot wait to show you how to build this house. This build is broken down into 9 steps, and without further ado, let's start the build. The main materials you need to create this ranch house are 192 sandstone blocks, 96 dark oak wood planks, 84 acacia slabs, 58 dark oak fence posts, 52 acacia wood planks, 40 daylight sensors, 28 dark oak slabs, 12 oak trap doors, 24 black stained glass panes, 12 stone brick stairs, 4 stone brick blocks, 3 dark oak stairs, 4 cobblestone wall sections, 2 acacia doors, and 2 glowstones. Also, here's a quick little side note. This desert ranch is roughly 12 by 12 blocks wide, and it is 7 blocks tall. These dimensions are helpful if you're building a neighborhood, and need to know how close you can build next to another house. Step 1. First, let's construct a 6 by 6 square made out of sandstone blocks. You will need 60 sandstone blocks for step 1. First, create a 6 wide row. Then pivot 90 degrees and add 5 blocks for a length of 6. Then add 5 more blocks to the side and connect back around. Then we can add 2 additional blocks on top of the base and this will make the wall a total of 3 blocks tall. And then once created, we will have a 6x6 six six square that is 3 blocks tall. Step 2. Next is create a rectangle on the left side of the square. For this step, we will need 168 sandstone blocks. Make the rectangle 2 blocks longer in the front. And make it 2 blocks longer in the back as well. And now we'll make the length of this new wall 10 blocks wide. Then make the rectangle a total of 6 blocks wide in the back. And this will make the total length of this rectangle 10 by 6 blocks wide. Then let's add 5 additional blocks to the base. So the wall is now a total height of 6 blocks tall. Step 3. Next, let's install a roof of dark oak planks on top of each tower. We will need 96 dark oak wood planks. Let's start by adding these planks on top of the sandstone walls. Step 4. Now we can finish the roof by adding decorative touches. We will need 84 acacia wood slabs, 36 dark oak fence posts, and 40 daylight sensors. First let's start by using acacia wood slabs, and attach them to the bottom half of the dark oak planks. And we can do this on both of the towers. Next, on the taller tower, attach dark oak fence posts under the acacia wood slabs. Then we can go back around and attach more slabs underneath.
Next, on both roofs, let's add daylight sensors to the top. Step 5. Next, let's make the stone archway. We will need 4 stone brick blocks, 12 stone brick stairs, 4 cobblestone wall sections, and 2 acacia doors. At the front left of the tower, move over a space and place 2 stone brick blocks. Then on the other side, move over a space and place 2 more stone brick blocks. Then add stair treads on top, and make them 2 wide, and then add an additional layer of stairs on top. Then we can add 2 layers of stairs on the other side as well. Next we can add in two acacia doors, and then add upside down stairs underneath. You can add the stairs in like this, or another option is like this. However, I think I like the first option better, so I'm going to stick with that. Step 6. Next let's make the window openings. We will need 24 black stained glass panes, 22 dark oak fence posts, 12 oak trap doors, and 2 glowstones. On the right side of the tower, move over a space, then remove 4 standstone blocks, and then place glass window panes inside. Add trap doors on top, then on the side of the building, we can move over a space and remove the four sandstone blocks as well. And then fill in the opening with glass window panes. Place oak trap doors on top. And then we can repeat on the back side, removing four spaces and adding trap doors on top. Then we can add dark oak fence posts in the corners next to the stone archway and add glowstones on top for lamps. Then we can add in dark oak fence posts in the corners, and make these three lengths tall. Then lastly, we can add in extra window openings. Move over one space from the edge of the taller tower, then make a two tall window opening. And then we can make another opening that is one space over and two spaces tall. Then we can add in three more similar windows around this tower. Step 7. Next let's move on the inside and install the first and second level floor. We will use 52 acacia wood planks, 3 dark oak stairs, and 28 dark oak wood slabs. I'm going to use acacia wood planks for the first floor. However, you can use whatever material you prefer best. Then let's make an opening so we can enter into the side room. Make an opening in the center of the right side wall. Now let's continue installing the acacia wood planks. Next, at the third space up, install dark oak slabs for the second floor.
Then we can add in a staircase out of dark oak stairs. And I'm gonna start this against the wall. Step eight. Next, let's work on the landscaping. I'm gonna use cactuses and I'm gonna place them around the house. Then to add to the desert landscaping, I'm gonna add in dead bushes. Step nine. Lastly is the interior, and I'll leave this completely up to you. However, I'll quickly show you how I did mine. Right inside is an entrance room with a side table, and it also has hooks on the wall. Then to the right is the kitchen, and this kitchen is outfitted with plenty of counter space, a stove, sink, and a fridge. Then we enter into the bathroom, and this bathroom is very compact, however it has a toilet and a sink. Then upstairs is the bedroom, and this bedroom has a full-size bed and a table in the corner. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you have any questions about the build or would like to leave some feedback, I would love to hear it. Also, make sure to subscribe because I create building tutorials just like this one every week. I'll catch you in the next one. Later guys. Want more build tutorials? I have many building playlists that might interest you on my channel. Make sure to check them out.